play from both players, but... Win. Mohova was up for love in the third. Oh boy, it's two really well shot in between that volley that she missed and the overhead. <laughs> this isn't the sharpest we've seen, Yelena, this year. Well, not with that volley that she missed and that overhead. Still got the game to light it up, though. That's more like it, Jeez. right? That's more what we've been seeing by the impact. It's absolutely ridiculous. Double gratification by Paolini. A virtual two bagel set, really, when you think of it. But uh, it's yeah, it's tough. I mean, Driscoll is going through a tough, rough patch. Wow. Well, that's the kind of point where Keen is going to have to win. Paolini is sending a pretty stern message. As you mentioned, Kevin, now at 21. chance to put this one away. And he goes back to her hallmark to get it done. It won't be chalked up as another ace, but it was a powerful statement to finish off strong after what had been an up and down opening set. Good dig, because that was a pretty effective drop shot. Looked like it was going to be Quinn beyond the reach, so. but the Indeed. long legs of the six foot with flair. It'll be intriguing now to see both of their reactions to the opening 13 games. Reba Kena. I think she kind of so. knew that that drop shot was coming. That'll keep her motor running. She can continue in this vein. This second set will not be a slog like it was in the first. And expertly played. I mean, just that little drop. Contra. 94 Jensen, minutes and the opening Fano, 69 were a stern six, question six mark one. posed to Elena Rabakina, but she passed that test. The second set, clear sailing as she knocks off the Italian Paolini in straight sets. It'll go down as a two set win, but it wasn't the easiest victory. But she has her second clay court win of the season and it'll feel oh so good to move back in the third round at the Italian Open. Victory assured, 7-6, 6-1 for the seven seed. And she advances on in Rome.